everybody, this is Captain Banks here for Day Zero TV, and today I'm talking about something that's really, really useful, motion control. But I'm not talking about the Xbox, I'm not talking about the Wii or the PS3. Today, I am talking about the Leap Motion on the circuit board. Alright everybody, so the Leap Motion is pretty cool in my opinion. I know I say it a lot, but it is pretty cool. It was started by a startup company out in uh, San Francisco, California. Who was They were just fed up with the difficulty of 3D modeling using a mouse and a keyboard. So they wanted to do something that would be able to use your hands to do all the modeling just like you would do with like clay or whatever other modeling material like music. Thus, they created the Leap Motion. Right now, it's in its post-production phase. It's going to be released very soon. I think in February is the estimated release date. And right now, the starting price looks like it's going to be $70. So, it's pretty affordable for what it does. I think it is actually cheaper than Xbox 360 Connect. And speaking of the Connect, the, the Leap Motion is 200 times more accurate in picking up motions and gestures than any other device out there like it. And I'm talking about this little USB device that's gonna sit in front of your computer that's about the size of your iPhone. I mean, it, it's pretty cool. It's really, really powerful. And I mean, they uh, make a joke on their website and say it took 300,000 lines of code in order to make the product. Anyways, so this little device in front of your computer projects basically this box, this two by two by two box right in front of your computer and it detects like your hands and your fingers and your arms and whatnot and it can actually tell what is what. Like the device knows that your index finger is your index finger, knows your thumb is your thumb. If you're wearing a watch, it will know you're wearing a watch. If you're holding a pencil, if you're holding chopsticks, it will know you're holding something. I mean it's just really super accurate and it works great so far with modeling software that they've kind of developed to work with the Leap Motion. Speaking about motion, it is all fully motion gesturing, so they say that in the future you will not need a mouse or a keyboard, because everything will be using gestures. It comes, the program that it uses is going to come with several gestures that are built in, that are pretty intuitive and, well, easy to use obviously, but that is also completely customizable. You can do like a gesture like that and you can make it do whatever you want. I mean, you can go like that and go back and forth on web pages. I mean, you can write your signature and it will look like your signature because of how accurate this thing is. It's really, really cool. It's a great innovation. I'm really excited to see it. I'm probably gonna buy one in February when it comes out. And, oh, by the way, it's gonna work right out of the box with Windows 7, Windows 8, and Mac OS X Mountain Lion, which is just phenomenal. Because I can't tell you, like, we, I, I tried to adapt a uh, Xbox 360 Connect to work with my iMac at work, and, you know, five hours of hacking later, it still doesn't work right. So this is going to be great for developers, it's going to be great for uh, business people, it's going to be great for, hey, everybody. Well, that's all I got here, and uh, after you're done watching my video about the Leap Motion, go ahead and check out the newest episode of the Anaholic Time Chamber where I am a guest star and we talk about the PETA Pokemon. That's all I have, that's the circle board.